The city wants to create projects the South Side community can see so they don't lose faith in the future. Over 20 some years of talking, meeting to meet, developing a plan. Uh, I'm I'm optimistic we're moving in the right direction. Stanley Sims is a community activist. He's talking about the South Side Action Plan, something the city of Tallahassee and Leon County are now taking to the next phase after years in the making. An old version of the South Side Action Plan from the late 1990s was revamped in 2021 by the city and county. In 2021 and 2022, they executed phases one and two of the plan. Those phases figured out what the South Side community members want to improve their quality of life. Their response, public and private investment, like more homes and businesses, beautification, more engaged community members who put their time and energy into making it a better place to live themselves, and government support to help bring about those changes to the area. In 2023, Mayor Pro Tem Diane Williams-Cox says phase three is now time for action. This is an evolution. Things evolve. Needs are, are, are ever evolving. Technology is forever changing. Communities are forever changing. Wednesday, city commissioners adopted the plan, which will put phase three into motion. This will roll out community-driven projects that can be done quickly so the community can see the changes on a shorter-term scale. Things like more sidewalks, neighborhood cleanups, and rehabilitation of homes and businesses. If businesses are there, then there will be jobs there. So we're looking forward to that. The blueprint projects, of the 32 blueprint projects that are slated to happen within the next five years, 18 of them will be happening somewhere within that Southside Action Plan. Over $471 million of public projects are happening on the South Side since 2017. In Phase 3, the city will also work to attract more private development in the area, something Sims hopes will keep the momentum going. It's not been so much talk, and it has been some walk. The city plans to track the progress online as they go so the community can see the changes as they happen. Live in Tallahassee, Alexa Trishler, ABC 27.